Hey, sixth graders, it's practice page 9.3.2, all about complementary and supplementary angles. All right, so this first section right here is asking you to find the angle that is complementary. I remember from the video that the teacher traced over the C and added a line. We can kind of see the number 90 hanging out here. So if we want complementary, then we need to make a 90 degree angle. So if you know what goes in this spot, great. You know the complementary angle, but if you don't, this becomes a minus problem where you take away the known degree. So because they told us 20, that's what we're gonna take away. In your calculator, 90 take away 20, 70. That means that 70 degrees goes in this blank, and I can always check my answer. 20 plus 70 is 90. So this number right here goes with this letter right there. 70 degrees is E. Here it is under 70 degrees, I write E. Okay. That first one wasn't too tricky, but let's look at S here. We're still looking for complementary angles. So we need to add something to make 90 degrees. This one isn't quite as easy, but if we just turn this into a minus problem where we take away what we know, then it's not so hard. Take away 14 gets us to 76. That means 76 degrees should be the correct answer. 76 plus 14, yep, gets us back to 90. So this 76 degrees goes with S, 76 degrees, S, okay? So same basic idea for the next section, except this time we are looking for supplementary. When I watched the video, I saw the teacher copy the S and then kind of make this connecting line across, and it kind of sort of looked like an eight, and you can make that be 180 degrees. Kind of have to use your imagination, but we're in art school. So let's look at E. So we have to add to 56 degrees to end up with 180 degrees. If you don't know, turn it around and make it a minus problem. 180 degrees minus 56 degrees. In our calculator, 180 minus 50, 56 is 124 degrees. And we'll just check our work by adding 56. Yep, right back to 180. So 124 degrees is E. Do, 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 do. There it is. Another E. Okay. How about this section down below? I really like a whole bunch of things that are hiding in here. Right. Something that I notice is that this bottom line is a straight line which means all of this area from here to here must equal, must equal 180 degrees. We, or we could say that if this area from here to here is a right angle, then this is 90 degrees. And if that's a right angle, then this side over here together has to equal 90 degrees. So this question mark here, 60 degrees plus question mark equals 90 degrees. And if you don't know the answer, turn it around and make it 90 minus what you know. 60 equals 90 minus 60 equals 30. So that means the question mark is 30 degrees. This question mark is 30 degrees. So if I add up all three of these numbers now, we should get 180 degrees. Let's try it out. 90 plus 30 plus 60 is 180 degrees, great. So the answer to this problem 
is 30 degrees N. 30 degrees N. Where are you? 30 degrees. There it is. N. We'll look at one more together. We'll look at... Uh, we'll look at this one, F, right here. I see along the bottom a straight line. Straight lines equal 180 degrees. From one arrow to the other arrow, you can kind of see half a circle. Not my best half circle. Maybe if I make it a little more like this, you can see it. So this question mark right here, that angle, what does it have to equal so that together it's 180? So let's see, 35 plus question mark equals 180. And if I don't know what that is, I'll turn it around. 180 minus 35 equals 180 minus 35. 145 degrees. All right, so I'm going to go back to my question mark and rewrite that as 145 degrees. And then I'm going to put this in my calculator. Whoa, that wasn't what I was trying to do. I'm going to put this in my calculator and see if that's true. 35 plus 145. Yep, it does equal 180. So this question mark... This question mark, I'm going to change to 145 degrees. That is F. 145, there you are, F. Okay, you will need to finish this side. Just keep thinking, is it supplementary, is it complementary? Am I working to make it be 90 degrees, or am I working to make all of it be 180 degrees? You got this, make sure you check in with a friend if you're not sure, or come and find me.